Okay, I found a uh, manual online, so I now know a little more. Uh, apparently, the jar is for part of the the kite project. A lot of you who are um, Americans, U.S. citizens, probably already knew that. Well, maybe. It's apparently he made some kind of battery. Uh, and you needed some of these parts for that. I didn't know that because we don't really learn much about Benjamin Franklin in school. I don't know. Guess it's not important for a Dane, you know? So let's, um... Or maybe I just wasn't paying attention. That might be it too. So let's try doing some of this. We need to take this and place it on that. Ah, oh, Yeah. Pepper carefully lines the jar with the tin. Now, and we need a metal rod. We're on a mission from rod. Uh, but I don't know where the fuck I'm gonna find a metal rod. I thought maybe from this thing. Pepper can use that here. Use what? Uh, let's look at this. This bin contains assorted gears and machine parts. Maybe you won't find a metal rod there. I don't know. Uh, I might have to look at a guide, but for now we actually can do something this video. One of the things being, like, ass assembling this, uh... I think it's a battery. I might be completely wrong. I didn't read that much about it. Sorry. We need to get the water from the bucket. Because that's apparently the only place you can get water in this entire world. Well, in Philadelphia, anyway. That must suck. Uh, can I do something with this? Maybe there's a metal rod in this. <gasps> Probably not. But let's check it out. Otherwise, this this whole place would now be completely wasted when there's no guards anymore. But I guess they maybe they just didn't need to they want to change that. The style is now open, and no one is guarding it. And let's take this. Peppa doesn't want to close the style. Uh, the still, the style, I don't know how to pronounce that. She's glad. with Really glad, apparently. The sentries are gone. Yeah, me too. Well, I'm her, so... Well, I'm not her. Ah, shut the fuck up. Let's go this way. We need to get to that bucket of water. You know, by the the stocks. Uh, okay. We still need to get the key and a key and a the key and the metal rod. The key I know how to get, uh, except for the fact that I don't know who to give the proverbs to. I was thinking maybe I needed to like get into the Puck's house. Like, for instance, saying, hey, I got a delivery, and, but actually have a delivery. Let's actually look before doing the water thing in my inventory, see if there's anything that might look like something you could deliver. A tomato? Yeah, I'm, I'm here to deliver a tomato. What the hell's this? The pamphlet says, the doctrines of personal mellowness. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yep, we already read this. But I also think that I needed to do something more for that bakery lady. Gumdrops. I might be wrong though. So let's fill this with water. That's not a good idea, but that's a good idea. But there isn't enough water in the bucket to fill the jar. Why don't you look for water somewhere else? Oh, you fucking son of a bitch. You fucking, fucking, fucking son of a bitch. Don't know who I'm talking to, but... Fucking. Jesus. I'm gonna fill it with mud. I don't give a shit. My name is Mud. Fun fact. That expression actually comes from, and don't quote me on this, I might be wrong, but this is what I have learned. The expression, my name is Mud, um, is actually because the doctor who uh, treated, what's he called? Booth? I can't remember his first name. The guy who shot Lincoln, John William Booth, that's probably not it. But that guy, the, the doctor who treated him after he was wounded, escaping from the the opera house or the theater, I don't know which it was, he, that guy's name was Booth. No, not Booth, it was Mud, with uh, two Ds, M-U-D-D. -D. And, um, oh, wait, 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 what does this say again? I can't remember. But yeah, the, his his name was Mud, and that's why that's uh, and 
So the expression, let the current be passed to a standback. Oh, this is just a standback. Never mind. And the expression, my name is Mud, is actually... I guess it's when you made a mistake without knowing it. Because that was a fact. He didn't know that that guy has just assassinated Lincoln. Uh, did I say Lincoln before? I think I said the wrong name. I might be wrong about saying the wrong. I still need to get in here, you old so and so. So and so. You old so and so. Oh, I get it. Um, because I need some fabric for the kite, I think. And I probably need that from in here. Let's go into Mrs. Gumdrop's bakery shop. The old sprouts and rice, which really doesn't sound like a bakery shop. Does you have water? Does. <laughs> what? Does you have water? Wait a minute. I know what to do. I'm an idiot. I'm a big, big idiot. And I'm sitting in a very weird way right now. Which you can't see, I'm all cr crouched forward, that's not the right expression, all hunched forward. And with my neck all the way down to my head, to my body. Yeah, it's hard to describe, I don't know why I'm sitting like this. And now I can't sit like anything else, because I've wrecked, wrecked my body. Yeah, water! Right here, look, this is water. I'm gonna... Just ignore those two and take some water. Yay! I'll just fill this jar with water if you don't mind. Well, honorably we charge you for it, but I hate to see a little boy go thirsty. You've got my permission, lad. I actually thought permission, right? When I started oh thank you ever much, dweebs. I thought that when I started playing this that I would go through different time periods, but I guess this isn't the case. But that's okay. Still a fun game. Now we have water in, let's leave. I don't can't stand the sight of these two motherfuckers. Morons. Leave. Oh, we had to go up there away from the path? That makes sense. So now we need to put uh let's go into my inventory. Now we need to put this thing in here. That's right. Pepper carefully places the stopper into the partially latent jar. Latent jar. I've heard that before. Latent jar. Oh, but now we need a metal rod. How the fuck am I... What's this? This is cut and string. Oh, alright. A magnet. I'm probably gonna need the magnet to... Oh, sorry. To use on something. Can I go back into this alley? Oh, I can. wonder if there's anything in there I missed. Uh Close. Mm, nope. Nothing of importance here. I need a metal rod. And I need to get oh, that's those last two um thingamajigs. What's it called? Uh proverbs. I don't know who the hell to give them to. I mean, who the fuck to give them to. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go look up in... Um, I was about to say Einstein. Uh, Benjamin Franklin's house for the metal rod. And then, if I can't find it, I'll probably end the episode, the video. Uh, but we did, it so far did good, we like did a whole lot actually. So that's pretty cool. I'd, I'd consider this a successful video, if, even if we ended it here. But I just don't think it's long enough when, if we ended it here. And we might as well just go looking for stuff. Ah, we need something to drink. Should have prepared myself more. But I didn't. So what you gonna do? Uh, I'm gonna open the door, that's what I'm gonna do. But she said, don't need the matches right now, which means we do need the matches later, I guess. Huh, I can't go in here, that's because she 
she doesn't want to be rude even though she is walking all around his house anyway. Um, oh yeah, you need... Oh, there was something about this thing. It's a small wooden stool. There's a huge crack in one of its legs. I'm gonna take... This string right here. And I'm gonna tie the chair. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, I, I'll bet we need this to get onto this. I'm not sure though. I still don't. I still wonder why this chain is here. It's nothing. I can't do anything with it. A metal rod. A metal fucking rod. Let's go out into the garden again. Maybe there's a metal rod. I'm scratching my nose, by the way. Oh wait a minute! I need this. The big folding, st folding step stool. We need this. Pepper doesn't want the step stool. Yes, I do. Don't tell me what I want or want not. You know, I need this. A metal rod. Pepper can't reach the pipe. No, that's why you need this. Jesus, lady. What are you fucking. Oh, wait, what did I do? <laughs> Is that a metal rod? Am I taking a metal rod? Pepper picks up the iron rod. Iron rod, well, that's a metal. Ben doesn't seem to need it. Ooh, he looks quite surprised or scared or... I don't know what the hell that expression is. Frankly, it's... Kinda scary. I'm gonna leave. You you, you creep me out, Franklin. Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. There's something over here, you see it? That look, uh, looks a little odd. Let's, oh, wait, let's look at it first. It's a home of... No, that rock. Come on, is that no nothing? Why would it they... Come on, this is something, this has to be something. Why the hell did they, like, make this rock so... different then? Okay, lame. Okay, now we have a metal rod, but before... Oh. But before we use it in the experiment, I'm gonna try to see if... I can use it in the step in here as a temporary. That won't fix the broken rocks. Well, it, it it might. Oh, maybe we can use it as a lever. Ow! You know, screw this then. I'm just gonna place it in this thing. Yay! Pepper puts the metal rod through the center of the stubber. It's perfect. The laden jar is done. Awesome. Hey, okay, good thing I came back here then. Still. What do I need a tomato for? And what's this? I'm gonna look at it. Oh, what a taggy hat. Wait, is that, is that, what? Is that a hat? I'm gonna take it. Pepper doesn't want the coon skin cap. Oh, it's a raccoon hat. Oh, coon skin. I thought it was... I thought it was something racial. I'm thinking, what the hell? Uh, Peppa doesn't want to mess with Ben's stuff, she might break something. Who gives a shit? Already screwed up history as it is. That's a really nice desk, that's true. The stool is broken. Peppa's afraid it might break if she tries to use it for anything. I'm gonna take this hammer. No, I need it to fix the stool so I can get up the ladder. I mean... Can I move this? Let's see if I can take any of the books. Just fuck. <laughs> Probably not. Well, let's just try. Nope. What's this? I'm gonna look at it. This is Ben Franklin's workshop. No, that. Oh, that's a candle. Oh, it's a candle. I'm gonna take the candle. Pepper doesn't want the candle. Why can you look at the candle? Doesn't make any fucking sense. But I do have a thing now, which I think is some kind of battery th of sorts. Not sure though. So yeah, oh, sorry. Wouldn't run on without this lever. No, but I wanna pull this chain. Ha <laughs> ha Pull this, pull. Uh, pull the chain. Oh, wait, oh, what did I say? 
Oh man, I'm too short to climb up past those broken. If only I had something to step on. You have this! What's this? Need a bag of plaster? Yes, I do. I do need a bag of plaster. Don't tell me what I need and what I don't need. I'm gonna fix this stool with the tomato. If I can't use that here, I'm gonna fix this with the tomato. You know, tomatoes fix everything. It's a little known fact. Anyway, <laughs> before this gets too silly, well, too late, let's look at this. It's a painting of Philadelphia streets at night. Street lanterns glow softly against the sky. Oh, that's so romantic. Not really. Anyway, I'm gonna end the video right here. Hey, face the camera, you little girl, boy, whatever you are. And what's this? Oh. God damn it. Oh, the tool chest contains a font of type of printing press. Looks. Pebble sees a lot and lots of little bit of letters of metal bars. Ooh, let's take some. G Jesus, I want them. I want them. I want this. I want this. I want this book. I want this barrel. No, oh, I want it all. It's like a really nice Queen song. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna end the video here. Next time, I will probably have looked through a guide because I really don't know what to do. I'm gonna just... Shut up, computer. I'm just gonna take like one clue or something, not like read through the whole guide, that's no fun. Just so that I can get a l little further. Anyway, see you next time. Bye.